The Japanese version of The Evil Within 2 has various censorship related changes due to the restrictions imposed by the Japanese rating system. Yes, despite being a Japanese game, the developers Tango Gameworks had to tone the game down in its home country. This was also the case with the first game released in 2014, however unlike the first game, this time there is no gore mode DLC to bring back some of the original content. You see, the first game was released with only a D rating in Japan, meaning 17 years and up, but a DLC was made which increased the game's violence, but also bumped the game's rating up to a Z rating, meaning 18 years and up, as well as placing a few restrictions on how it's able to be sold. However, even with this DLC, the game was still censored in places, as the Japanese rating system will not allow certain content even with the max rating. This time around, The Evil Within 2 was released with the Max Z rating from the get-go, with no special DLC. This means that not as much content had to be altered, but there are still quite a few differences from the Western version. The first of these affects any instances of open wounds on human characters that reveal internal organs or other graphic details. While simply blood is fine, as soon as you can start to see things like bits of brain matter, the Japanese rating system will step their foot down. Due to this, scenes like this were altered in Japan by retexturing the surfaces and blackening areas of the exposed wounds. Here's another example of a human corpse with a graphic wound, this time to the stomach. Due to being able to see his intestines, the Japanese version completely darkened the area like so. For much of the game though, particularly during story cutscenes, the violence doesn't exceed that which the Japanese rating system permits. Also, whilst moments like this may seem especially gory, it was allowed to be shown in Japan uncensored, most likely due to the fact that you can only see red flesh, and not things like internal organs. There was more censorship to violence though, and this affects the death animations that will play out when you get killed by the various enemies and bosses. Different animations will play depending on what killed you and how, and in the western version, things can get pretty gruesome at times. Early on in the game, for example, you are chased down a corridor by a huge monster wielding a circular saw. At one point, a QTE will play out, and whilst most players won't fail this short bout of button mashing, if you were to fail, the monster will slice your torso completely in half, and then leave you dangling in the air. In the Japanese version, the animation stays the same, but the camera is positioned higher up, hiding all of the violence. Here it is again, but side by side. There are a few more death animations that were censored, and one of these is from the same enemy but dying in a different way. If you get killed prior to the QTE segment, the monster will instead slice your leg off like so, leaving it visually dismembered, and then proceed to cut your body in half, which allows you to then see the sliced body parts scattered across the screen. Over in Japan, not only does the leg stay firmly attached to his body, but the camera angle was then changed during the second part of the attack to hide the torso being cut in half. However, it's not just violence that Japan's censors have an issue with. Despite common misconceptions, sex is treated very strictly in Japanese video games. While suggestive, non-explicit stuff is fine, the Japanese rating system does not allow graphic sex and nudity. This is the reason why most Japanese games are always only ever suggestive in nature and don't actually show things like nipples, because if they did, they would need to be censored in Japan. Within the Evil Within 2 is a reoccurring enemy with a very deformed female-like figure. One of the creature's moves is an attack where they grab you and spray acid in your face, and this allows you to get a good view of its chest, which as you can see has feminine breasts and nipples. Due to this, the creature had to be changed in the Japanese version so that its nipples are completely removed, as shown here. It's important to point out though that these rules only apply to titles rated by Japan's Sero rating system, and Sero is only responsible for console games and not PC releases. So whilst the PS4 and Xbox One versions of the game are censored in Japan, it is possible to pick up the Japanese PC version and still play the game uncensored. Sensor Gaming has covered games censored in Japan many times now, and unless the strict rules of Japan's rating system change, we're likely to continue doing so. If you're interested in seeing more comparisons like this, then please make sure to hit that subscribe button, and until next time, thank you for watching.